I can't even tell you how often that people say, well, you don't look like a farmer. Nobody's ever accused me of being um, anything but prim and proper. Nobody's ever accused me of being an athlete, you know, anything like that. I'm from Franklin, Tennessee. Um, born in Nashville, but you know, raised in Franklin. Um, was not raised on a farm. I do not have a farming background. I was raised in a neighborhood. Got into farming by marriage. Um, when my husband and I first got married, we both had jobs, but we grew about an acre garden just for us and our family, and that made us the most happy. So I kind of made it my mission to figure out a way that we could do it full time. So we quit our jobs and sold our car for seeds and became farmers. <laughs> like me, this is our greenhouse. This is where we start every single one of our seeds. It was hard. It was really hard. You can't just decide um, to feed 100 families this year. You know, we um, had to kind of prepare for that. So it started the first year with us just growing food for, like I said, our friends and our family. Well, this thing, it's covered in mud, but it pokes a hole in the ground and you sit here and it fills that hole up with water and then you put the plant in the fresh little water. Our CSA is really cool. It's a little bit different from most of the CSAs that are out there. We call it our farm elite. All of our pickups are on the farm. We don't do deliveries. It's like kind of like a buffet line and you fill up your basket with whatever you want for the week. I do feel like women farmers are in the minority, but I just think all farmers are in the minority these days. I feel like we definitely need more farmers all the way around. In our area, we have a really neat um, gathering of women farmers, and I really love going to that and getting inspired. It's interesting being a mama and a farmer um, because it's hard for people, I think, to put me in a box because sometimes I'm a full-time working mom and sometimes I'm a part-time working mom. Uh, one of the biggest things about me and most women farmers that I know is you can't box us in. Um, and if you tell me, you know, well, you don't look like a farmer, well, just come out to the farm and watch me work because I, I can outwork anybody. 